Hello and welcome to Facts Action YouTube channel. All right, so here I have another uh, trick or method for you guys how to remove Google account from LG Stylo 4 or 4 Plus. Probably it's gonna work for that model also. So let's put a password first and let's see if it has a Google account or not. Once we make sure, then we can try to unlock it. Uh, through a Bluetooth headphone or a Bluetooth device, especially these earphones, and it's it's a very easy. You don't have to worry. All right, so now let's see. All right, so we see that it got a Google account. All right, so let's go back. Now the first thing you have to do is connect it to Wi-Fi. That's the first thing. Second thing, you just press uh, uh, accessibility option here. And here you see the switch access. Here you'll see settings or you can uh, turn on uh, switch access if it's off. If you turn it on, so directly it will take you to a Bluetooth connection. So here is Bluetooth switch press next and press allow now is requesting to, to turn on now turn on this bluetooth earphone wait for a minute and see if it's gonna be uh, visible here sometimes it won't be visible so all you have to go back and come back so that's how it's gonna work okay so let's see here all right so now we are ready and make sure that uh, you, your bluetooth device is a pairing is in a pairing uh, mode so now here the name for this device is v8 we're connecting that v8 with our phone so it's connected usually every bluetooth headset or earphone comes with a call button or answering button once you press that call button the Google voice assistant will pop up if you don't know which one is the call button uh, just check the guide which came with your Bluetooth headset or try the headset on another phone uh, all right so let's see um, and press this call button and here you go the Google voice assistant just popped up oh here let's see how to okay so here what we got all right so now click on search here you see search now type email and here it is email app click on other put your email the one you have the information for it the one which you forgot forget about that one okay fix in action let's type this email at gmail.com so here you will see the manual setup click on manual setup and click next come down and here you will see client certificate click on add button will give you a message that use credential storage change to a secure lock first click on change click on pattern and then require pattern click next now draw a new pattern confirm so now the phone has a uh, lock new lock and restart the phone or go back now here start again the setup wizard skip next let's see what we're gonna get do i remember the new pattern i hope so let's try our new pattern all right that's it we did it you can go ahead and reuse your phone 
in case if it's not working for the first time try restarting the device and try again with your new patron thank you guys for watching my videos hit like and subscribe for my coming videos that i'm gonna upload and share with you guys